Let's talk about the direction of the energy of this planet. There's good energy and evil energy. In Chinese, the word feng shui means wind and water and influences harmony in our life. But the way that the media and governments bombard us with violent acts, bad economy, and natural disasters, the world does not feel in harmony or in balance. I like to use the word from the fractal body of knowledge called self-analyzing criticality. This means the naturally occurring stopping point. For example, it's a natural brake system like when all the energy stops the momentum of an avalanche, a hurricane, or shoreline erosion. <clears throat> now, although the negative energy of this planet is coming into the light, the stopping point is determined by the raised consciousness that the majority of people choose to focus their energy their thoughts and actions to develop the reality. So one person cannot stop the negative energy of the entire planet because we don't have control over others. Here's the solution. One, as an individual, we have control over our own thoughts and actions that cause our own individual energy, our individual momentum. Two, as an individual of higher consciousness, we have influence over others as mentors and role models to assist the race consciousness of others. So control and influence will illuminate our individual light upon this world. Our control and influence involves our authenticity and integrity to live by the highest standards possible to reflect truthfulness that benefits the good of others and eventually all on the planet. Pretend you are the avalanche that temporarily disconnects, disconnects from the surrounding system in balance to fall off into a different energy, a different momentum. You hold the control of your own self-organizing criticality. This means that you are indeed in control to stop the momentum of your own energy. How? One, change your thoughts. Stop engaging in thinking that is not benefiting you. If your thoughts don't serve you for good, let them go. Your brain is a computer that will do anything you tell it to do. Two, stop all brain momentum. Take a 15 minute nap and stop the momentum of thinking. Meditation is a skill that's easy and relaxing to learn to slow down brain momentum. We cannot stop all brain activity because we are in physical form and our physical senses will always give us input of our surroundings. 3. Filters and Boundaries Self-examine yourself for allowing outside influences of media, family, education, community, and history to affect your mental state of well-being. You can identify your personal triggers, the avalanches in your momentum. If you exercise prevention and develop a higher consciousness of your own truth and authenticity, no one and nothing can enslave you into darkness and lower consciousness. No one can ever take that away from you. When you become awake to your own individual truth, you will then awaken to the true world that surrounds you. When you raise your consciousness, you will naturally develop a momentum to raise the consciousness around you. Think of it like switching from 4G to 5G. The struggle to upload higher consciousness 
becomes immediate. Your physical body will naturally adjust to any momentum of energy under your control and by your initiation. So, self-analyzing criticality is a real effect upon the increased degree of higher consciousness on a global scale. The negative energy in the form of lies by the media, governments, and education systems, disaster weather, economic slavery, opportunistic genocide, etc. will stop. It begins with the individual. It begins with you and me. For the greater good, it's worth the effort.